I really wanted to write a love story, and it is a comedy, but I wanted to have the obstacles for this couple to be very real and to be very daunting. And so by the end of the play, and I'm not going to say what happens to this couple by the end of the play, but by the end of this play, you do have a real appreciation for what it is to be in a long-term relationship. And the show's hysterical. I mean, Richard has written a great play. His dialogue is so, so fluid, and it's so much about relationships. I mean, we've all talked, had stories about, God, that reminds, reminds us of being around our kitchen tables and the conversations between our parents. And uh, it's, it's so funny. It's like The Honeymooners. It's like, for mm. me, the play was like The Honeymooners meets Beckett. There's this <laughs> existential thing going on, but there's this brilliant, insightful uh, and very very funny writing if people like movies they're gonna love this mm. you know and the mm. whole idea of the gang the whole genre of gangster movies is so in this and you know th we're aware of uh, Mick one of great of Mickey's great um, things as a as a theatrical character is he's aware of his own drama he's aware of the, the movie that he's in his movie and he's the star of his own movie and uh, there's some sort of quintessential writing that's right out of film noir and, or a yeah. Scorsese film. 